Welcome, welcome, welcome back to the channel. It's that guy, so fly, Energy Eli. Please do make sure you comment, like, share, and subscribe. Jimmy Butler stuns with new look at Heat Media Day. Jimmy Butler's offseason didn't go as planned after his Miami Heat lost out on the Damian Lillard sweepstakes. Is he wearing his emotions on his head? The Heat All-Star showed up with an unexpected new look at Media Day on Monday. Jimmy Butler said, I'm emo. Butler said of his new dude, this is my emotional state. I'm one with my emotions, so this is what you get. Butler didn't elaborate much more on his new hairstyle, nor did he say how long the look would last. He similarly showed up with a new style to last season of Media Day, supporting, or excuse me, sporting what he described as dreadlocks. They didn't survive the season, but lived on his media day headshots. In fact, when ESPN stopped using his media day photo, he kindly requested last season that they continue to do so. Jimmy said, I don't think it's right, Butler told USA Today last season. I think I should be able to wear my hair however I want to wear my hair. You're supposed to be using my media day picture. Put my hair back the way it was because I love that hairdo on me. As for Lillard, Butler said he was happy for Dame to be somewhere he is wanted, despite that not being on Butler's heat team. Uh, Jimmy said, I'm happy for Dame to be somewhere he's wanted, where he has a chance to win a championship. I'm also happy for Adrian Griffin because to be a first year head coach and have some guys like you have, good for you, Butler said. But you know, I am still going to be me. I am still going to beat Dame, Giannis, and Adrian Griffin on our way to a title, like I said, every single year. I mean it this year, like I mean it every other year. He was asked if he thought the Heat had done enough to build around him to compete for a championship. Yeah, we're straight, Butler said. Like I always say, I know what I'm capable of. I know what my guys are capable of. So we'll continue to play basketball as a unit, as a team, and somehow, some way, end up in the finals. This time, we're going to win it all. So, um, as, as stated, Jimmy Butler showed up to media day with a rather unique hairstyle. Now, you know, some, you know, uh, say it's him expressing himself. Some say it's another, you know, form of emasculating, you know, uh, males, in particular black males, whatever the case may be. Um, this has not been, this is something that's not new. Um, if, if you guys remember, if you're old enough, you remember Larry Johnson with the grandmama thing. Um, even Michael Jordan, he had a thing where he dressed up as a, 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 a grandma. Uh, you will see it a lot with a lot of entertainers and actors and, you know, uh, sports personalities, whatever it may be. Um, like I said, Jimmy said he's expressing himself. Hey, cool, fair enough. But it's one of those things, fellas, where it's expressing yourself, but then it's a point where, okay, who's behind this of you expressing yourself? Because this isn't the first time Jimmy Butler's done something like this. Literally just a year ago, as he mentioned, he came in with fake dreads. That was weed in his hair. So what I'm merely saying is, fellas, you know, uh, when it comes to masculinity and certain things, we just need to be mindful of what we do um, because some things just never will be masculine, no matter how we try to cope, no matter how we try to go around it, no matter how we try to go about it. Now, listen, I'm not taking anything away from Jimmy Butler's game. Jimmy Butler is a dog. Jimmy Butler is a great player. He's worked very hard. He used to play for my Chicago Bulls, you know, so that's where he started his career. So I have nothing against Jimmy Butler. But the thing is, as we know, when you continue to go up a certain level, when you continue to attain certain things, it's going to be certain things that's going to be asked. OK, cool. If you want to be this guy, if you want to be that guy, if you want to do this, you want to do that. So all I'm merely saying is. I don't know what's behind this. I don't know what's going to go on, but I guarantee he's not going to play with this hairstyle. But it's definitely something that's that's going on and something that's just a bit deeper that isn't being told, you know. So, fellas, at all at all costs, you know, please continue to protect your masculinity. Please continue to be careful, man. Don't sell out for a bag in a way. You know, have dig dignity, have morals, have, you know, certain things you're willing to fight for. You don't have to do this and still get a bag. You still do what you got to do hoop and still get the bag no matter what so stay focused and stay vigilant fellas uh, once again my name is energy eli please do make sure you comment like share and subscribe hey i'm out believe